And today, I want to tell you a story about a guy who, who's overcome so much in his life. I think a lot of us will hit barriers or roadblocks in life and we'll find reasons to not keep going, not pushing through, or we'll throw in the towel. We'll call it quits. We'll say, I can't help this. These are the cards that I'm dealt. I'm stuck with this problem forever. And yeah, it's probably going to affect my life and maybe even affect the life of my family too. Well, not this guy. You guys, if I showed you a picture of this, if you saw an x-ray that looked like that, do you ever think a man who had these rods in his spine would ever be pain free? Would ever be in a place to where he wasn't suffering, that he wasn't using that as his reason, excuse or reason up to you, but his reason why he couldn't do certain things. My guy, Michael, came to us from Atlanta with his entire family. They were referred to us by a chiropractor who was taking care of him back there, and he had let a little bit of time go between chiropractic care. Well, he came in with tons of back pain. Obviously, we know why. But here's the cool part. Fast forward a few months, he's pain free. Actually, if you ask him how he feels, his exact words were, man, I can't believe I feel this good. He's back working out, he's moving his body. The guy is ripped, he's chiseled, he's doing what he wants to do and living life on his terms. Better yet, his family, his wife and his two beautiful kids are now coming in for care too and they're getting precise in important neurological chiropractic care so that their life and their health could be as awesome as possible. Now people see pictures like that and they say, sure, there's structural change going on. Absolutely. But realize that structure has an impact on function because it affects your nervous system. Within that spine that the rods are attached to is your spinal cord. And your spinal cord has this incredible job its job is to control everything in the entire body. So you ask his youngest son, hey man, what controls things? And he goes, mm, I don't know, your head? And I said, pretty close, your brain. But your brain must have a way to send signals to every other part of your body. In Michael's case, including his muscles that support the spine and stabilize things, keeping his body all jacked up. Well, that nervous system can then send those signals, not only to the muscles, telling them to tighten up or relax, but also to the organs and the glands, the heart to beat, the lungs to breathe, the stomach to digest food, break it down, take it through the GI tract, assimilate what you need and get rid of the rest. So your entire functional output of your body is controlled by that nervous system because Michael's spine was jacked up affecting his nervous system when we got to see things go back to the proper position and we can't fix all that stuff guys, but we can change the impact it has in that nervous system. We can see him living life pain free his body working better, and his family getting healthier. So if you guys see Michael anywhere around the practice, give him a shout out, give him a high five, tell him he's awesome, and also tell him to give you some recommendations if you ever wanna to go to Atlanta and get some good eats, because he knows all the best places. You guys, hopefully this love fest is fueling you guys up too. If you have challenges in your health, any concerns, any problems, any issues, maybe you've tried everything, and people just don't have a solution or an answer for you, give us a call. You guys share this video out, let everyone who needs to see this video, see this video, and let people who need to get healthier give us a call or find a chiropractor in their local area that can help them get healthy too. Because life is just more fun when you have your health. You guys, until next time, Dr. Raff signing out. See you later, stay healthy, stay happy.